Hi there, this is Johnny, Man and Machine. I hope you're all well. This is going to be a quick demonstration of some of the new nodes inside of Dynamo. Um, I'm going to jump straight into it. So the first one we've got get all hosted elements. So everything in blue in these blue groups here are new. Um, so this allows us to essentially um, put in a load of elements and then find what's hosted in them. So for instance, doors. Um, in walls or windows in walls, we can get all those elements now that are hosted within a wall. So I've got a little node here that's getting all the walls and then it's giving me a list of all of the stuff that's hosted inside those walls. So inside here, we just have a bunch of walls. And so what I've done is I've actually created maybe the beginnings of a script here that would allow us to maybe change the fire rating of the door based on the type of the wall perhaps inside of Revit. Um, so that could be quite a useful little node for that kind of script. Next one we have the pin elements or is the element pinned nodes. So I've created a little um, node script here that allows us to take all of our grids, run it through here and say whether we want it to be pinned or not pinned. So I could say true, quickly run it. And then if I look in my Revit here, these are gonna be pinned. Likewise, if I don't want them to be pinned, I can set to false, run it and these will be no longer pinned. So that could be useful for all of your DWGs that you want to pin in one go, all your Revit files you want to, whatever you want to pin, essentially, you can run it through that script uh, and it'll set it to pin. So quite a useful um, new node there. Uh, we also have, last of all, these join nodes. Uh, I was maybe struggling a little bit to think of things that I could use these on. Um, one of the things that I have come across in the past briefly is joining columns in walls. Uh, so I can use this perhaps to, um, as an example, some of these these columns here aren't maybe joined with the walls and I need them to be joined. So I can say, select all these model elements here, select the wall itself, uh, run the script, and that'll just join them together. Um, so hopefully this has been useful. Um, I always find it useful to actually see applications of nodes uh, rather than just kind of what is new. Um, so hopefully there's a few ideas floating around here. Uh, there's plenty more if you go to the Dynamo forum about how these can be used. A lot of these things you could have probably done before with some of the packages, uh, but these are now built into Revit 2021. So like I say, I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please do get in touch with Man and Machine. Thank you for watching. Bye.